Hello, and welcome back to Pokemon Heart Gold. We are back in New Bark Town. I am the Ixalan. This is Red. This is where our family moved. She likes my Poke gear. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Uh, is this? <laughs> this is how bad it. This is how long it's been since I've been home. I don't remember. This is not my house. <laughs> I don't know where I live anymore. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's this one, right? Nope. You're not my mom. Oh, you are. <laughs> That's embarrassing. Just don't even know my own mother. Sorry. Or is this about your money? Holy crap. We have a lot of money. Uh, nah. I mean, keep that money. Do what you gotta do. Can I, like, rest here? I wanna take a nap. Me and Pillow Swine. Cuddle with Pillow Swine. You wanna cuddle? You so soft and fuzzy. Oh, yes, it's nap time. Okay, enough of that. I wanted to I wanted to rest. Why won't she let me sleep here anymore? You can't sleep here. Get out. No one likes you. Anyways, enough of that. We are here at Professor Elm's lab. Oh, I did not expect to see Lyra here. Did you already collect any badges? Hell yes, I did. I know, right? It's freaking awesome. Well, then let's go meet the professor. Hi, Professor Elm. Hi, Red. You never cease to amaze me. Thanks to you, my research is going great. You've caught seven Pokemon. Take this as a token of my appreciation. Master Ball. Master Ball is the best. It's the ultimate Pokeball. It'll catch any Pokemon without fail. It's given only to noted Pokemon researchers. So the Sylph Co. gave me one, like, three years ago. Had... What, what did I research? Research how to kill Team Rocket. That's what I researched. Boom. Said a group of beautiful kimono girls looking for... Hello. Where did they go? People are talking about me. I did. Uh, well, I helped... Well, she was stuck in the ice. I mean, I had to. You make me, pl you make me proud to be your friend. Tee hee. The kimono girls are waiting for you at the Ecritique Dance Theater. Is it for real? I thought the egg hatched. Where's the Pokemon? Come on, across. I could take Dance City. Oh, he wants to see the Togepi that doesn't exist anymore. Oh, poor, poor Elm. That's never gonna happen. I have we ever been here? I don't ever think we came up into Lyra's upstairs place. Hey, what's up, Lyra? How you doing? I wonder what a Kimono girl wants from you. Oh, you know what she wants. Bow, chicka, bow, wow. Uh, yeah. Alright, so that was that was pretty much it. I thought that was going to be more than just that. But I have to make the long trek to Akritik Theater, which... Let's look at our Poke gear. Uh, Akritik. Is this Akritik? No, this is Violet City. Akritik is here. So I have to go over to Cherry Grove north into Violet City and then I can I can take the shortcut here I think but I mean there's no point in making you guys watch that walk the whole way so I will be back when I get to Ecritique City okay we are uh, back in Ecritique City and while there are kimono girls waiting for me meow, I uh, instead will go here and you're like what the hell am I going here well, I got a call on the way over here from somebody named Chad and I don't know who that is, but I'm going to guess that it's either this guy or the sailor. Okay, so my guess is the sailor. We're going to grab this apricorn here. And they were like, do you want to battle? I'm on Route 38, and this is Route 38. So we're going to do a quick battle before we take on the kimono girls, kind of as a warm-up. Get some, get a little bit more experience for our good buddy Pillow Swine, Harry the Pillow Swine. Okay, so it's neither of these people. Are you Chad? Okay, now I'm just, like, super confused. Who the hell is Chad? Are you Chad? Oh, thank God. <laughs> Do you remember me? Do you want to battle? I'll battle you, but I have no idea who you are, kid. I'll be on Route 38. Okay, sure. We're going to hit him with secret power first. Uh, we're physically bulky, so the reflect was kind of crappy. How bad is that side beam on us? That's actually not too terrible. 
reduced accuracy. That's weird. I was I was expecting it to put him to sleep, which is why I did it. But we'll just finish him off with an ice shard because it's gonna be stabbed, so it'll be, I think, a little bit stronger. And that's some really good experience for Harry. Look at that HP gain. Our attack stat's pretty nice. Speed is horribly slow, which is why I'm relying on Ice Shard the most, because that's amazing. So I think we're just going to kind of do the same thing. We'll Secret Power. It's not going to do a whole lot. Um, it's going to take aim at us. I think I'm going to see how much Ice Shard does. Okay, it's about the same. How did that hit? I would expect that to be an electric move, and I'm part ground, so that shouldn't hit me at all. That's really confusing. And I'm faster than a Magnemite, which is also really weird. This whole battle was just very strange, school kid Chad. <sighs> yeah, you did not study enough. No, you're probably studying fine. I'm just way, way better than you. Look, sometimes there's just natural talent and dedication, and sometimes there's just the... Uh... PC versus NPC factor. I'm a PC, you're an NPC. That just means I win most of the time. Not always the case. Sometimes you can be the rival and the villain factor definitely has a major impact, but you know, whatever. Okay, so I believe we're gonna fight the kimono girls in this kimono tower here. So let me heal up real fast. Okay, here we are. Whoa. Um, how, how is this possible? How can I lose to mere kimono girls? Oh, hey, it's Dick Gobbler. You were watching me, Red. Yeah, that's right. I never thought defeating five kimono girls would be so hard. Bounce, bounce, bounce. I mean, I got beaten to a pulp. You must have come here for the same reason. Don't get cocky just because you defeated Team Rocket. We've been over this. I am Team Rocket. These kimono girls are insanely strong. Go ahead, take them on. I'm not going back. I don't want to see you win. Oh, so you admit that I'm going to win. You're just going to run away. That's ridiculous. He, like, that's the saddest thing I've ever seen. That guy has no chance. Five kimono girls. Do we have to fight back to back? Can I heal between them? Oh, my name is Zuki. Mm, hello, Zuki. In Violet City. Oh, yeah. In order to bring back Ho-Oh, we needed someone with the right bond with Pokemon. We asked Mr. Pokemon to give his mystery egg to whoever showed true potential. The egg was eventually handed from Mr. Pokemon to Professor Elm, and then to you. However, being pure alone will not be sufficient to face the power of this Pokemon. I must test you. Are you ready? Guys, are we ready? I think we're ready for the ho -Oh fight. Let's do this, lady. I will test how closely you've bonded with your Pokemon. Through battle. Oh, that is a cool load screen! The, uh... The Japanese sliding doors. Oh, I forget what those are called. Why am I drawing a blank on it? Oh, I remember this battle. Each one of them has one of the evolutions. This is the evolution battle. So we got Embryon, Espeon, Flareon, Vaporeon, and Jolteon. So I think Harry should be okay against most of these people. Dark pulses. Wow. Wow. Please put you to sleep. Nope. Okay. We're going to switch out to Mikey, who's going to resist the dark move. I guess I should have probably taken this fight a little bit more seriously. I was like, we'll just take on the Umbreons, but no. You're going to get, you're going to get wrecked, guy. Uh, I think I'm just going to, do I go revenge? I think I go revenge, right? That was probably a dumb move, but the revenge should kill you. Oh, you are that bulky? Okay. Uh, just Karate Chop, I guess. Yeah, you're gonna be faster than me anyways. And snapped out of confusion. Boom! Got there! Mikey for the win. The foe's Umbreon fainted. Okay. So that was pretty good. Wow. Okay. So we gotta, we gotta take these fights a little bit more seriously. We got freaking 4,500 for fighting you. Oh, it is, it is just back to back. You helped me in the Ilex Horse. I remember that. I'm the one that's not so good at directions. Aw, Naoko, I'm sorry. I just witnessed you defeating Team Rocket when Kurt was in trouble at the Slowpoke Well. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. Welcome. I welcome the challenge. Um, you're not good with directions, and you have an Espeon, which is... 
kind of scary. I don't... I think our best bet is actually Bully. Um, I hate having to switch and give you like a free Calm Mind or just straight Psychic. Don't crit! Jesus, okay. Um, do we... I guess I pursue, right? Or do I just strength? Uh, let's, let's think. This is, okay, don't, don't. We gotta look at the Pokemon. This is scary now. Okay, summary. Check moves. Nope. Go back, sorry. Okay, so strength is 80. So stab is gonna be 120 versus his defense and it's physical. The alternative is pursuit, which is gonna be two times weak, which is gonna be 80. So I think we go with strength. Strength seems like it should be the stronger attack. And if Espeon doesn't have the physical bulk that I... Oh, that's not good. Okay, well, we just lost Bully. Shiza. Um. Wow, guys. Did not, did not really expect that. There was, I mean, there wasn't really a lot I could do, though, because the Psychic was so strong, like, Espeon is a pure glass cannon. But that was just a bolt, like, I feel like Strength should have taken it down. That's kind of frustrating. Team Rocket Grunt from right here. Oh, okay. I, you are a trainer yourself. She who knows the most speaks the least. Miki, the kimono girl. Ah, uh, this is, okay. We gotta, please be Jolteon so that I can get, like, a free heal. Just don't be Flareon. God, son of a... Okay. Um, well, there's like a 70% chance that Flareon's going to use a fire attack, which means we have a pretty safe switch at the Chester here. Okay, went with the quick attack, which is also fine, because I have the bulk, so I think we're okay with surfing you to death. This should... Wow. We've not been able to Oko anything... Oh my goodness. Okay. This is really, really bad for us. Um, <laughs> I'm kind of scared, guys. I don't know what to do. I'm the one who skates in sandals, Sayo the Kimono Girl. I was listening in the Dragon's Den when you passed the test of the Elder. Allow me to challenge you and your Pokemon. That's creepy. I didn't even see you there. Sayo, you're like the creepy one. Okay, yes, Jolteon. Okay, this is good. This is good. Uh, so we're gonna have to heal here. <laughs> and that, that's, that's the only reason that it is good, is that it lets us get a Hyper Potion on Harry. And I don't know what Jolteon has that's not an electric attack. I'm assuming like a quick attack or a... I'm hoping not signal beam. Okay, you have double team. Okay, so we're going to take this opportunity to heal up for the next battle. We're going to use our full restore on Chester to get rid of all of that. And, okay, I think we're good. So you're using double team. What is an always hit move? I don't have an always hit move, do I? I mean, I'll go with secret power, like... What are you gonna... Eventually, this is gonna hit. <laughs> and you got paralyzed, okay. I'll go take down. Your evasion did not help you in the slightest. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah, okay, we're just gonna go ice shard until you die. Wow! That was crazy lucky. Like, that many double teams... All of our moves should have missed. Like, every single one of them should have missed. That's insane. And that's a really good attack stat. Okay. So that was that was almost almost repaying us for what happened to, to Bully. I am the last one. So dependable at the Goldenrod Tunnel. Twirls even underground. And you thwarted teams, Team Rocket's mission to take over the radio tower. You must show your strength to me now. Okay, so... Why did, why am I fighting you after I fight the girl who watched me at the Dragon's Den? Like, that's that just seems out of order. 
Was that translated inappropriately? Okay, so we have to not be here with Harry because Vaporeon is going to be really good. So we're going out to Chester again. I'm glad we got that full restore. So the Surf shouldn't be too bad. And we should be able to get pretty good damage with our Sparks. I was, yeah, I was not prepared for this fight, guys. This is, this has turned out very poorly for us. Um, well, it could have been much worse, but the fact that we lost Bully is really, really sad. So, I don't, I don't even know. We've got, we've definitely got some changes to make on the team, it looks like. I think we'll take a minute after this and, and look at our team and see what's going on. Okay, yeah, give me, give me the money, that's good. Did I pass? You are indeed worthy of this. Please take it. The clear bell. Okay. So the clear bell plus the rainbow wing will let me summon ho -Oh. Big sisters, I just saw the big shadow of a Pokemon over the bell tower. It could be. We'll be at the bed tower. <laughs> bed tower. We'll be at the bed tower. Bow. No, 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 no. Sorry. <laughs> See you there. So all the kimono girls and the little girl are going to the bell tower. I hope to god I don't have to fight them again. Mom, you better have given me like a million things. Did you... How many? How many is the, is the question here? Because there needs to be more than one after the freaking hell I just went through. God, that was crazy. I'm, I'm so sad about our, our loss of bully. Like he was, he was really, really strong. He was fast. A good physical attack stat. Papaya berries. That's obviously papaya. I just misspelled. Yes, give me more packages. Bobby D baddies. <laughs> I love saying that. We have the Bobby D baddies. Oh, sweet. The muscle band. I don't even know what the muscle band does. Is that the. Alright, let's. Well, let me. Let's, let's look at it. Uh, it should be here, right? The muscle band. Slightly boost the power of physical moves. I thought that was the one that increased the EVs you get. Or maybe I'm thinking of another move. I thought muscle band increased the EVs. I don't know. Anyways, so... Here's the, here's the situation. Let's look at our Pokemon and figure some things out. Because we've... We've got... <laughs> we're not in a good place is basically where we're going right now. We're not in a bad place, we're just not in the greatest place. Uh, let's take the Silk Scarf off Bully. And then he can go, unfortunately, into the grave. So over here in box three, this is our, our Trading Magoo, which we can use to bring back, again, uh, from last episode, the list of, of the previous season Pokemon are Hypno, Rapidash, Magneton, Snorlax, Gyarados, Voltorb, Pidgey, Hitmonlee, Meowth, Doduo, Horsey, Ghastly, Venonat, Goldeen, Lapras, Psyduck, Krabby, Primate, Tangela. That's quite the list. Um, the other options we have are Krill, our Dratini, Prissy, our Gligar, Bessie, our Miltank, could replace Bully. Um, we've got Ice Ground, pretty good, resistant to electric. We've got Water Electric. We've got a Fighting type to take care of Dark. We've got a Bug Poison type to take care of some... Actually, you're probably not the best person, Garrett or uh, Gale, but I mean, you're not terrible. And you have Ghost Moves, which actually does help against some Psychic types. And then we want Denryu to retire. Um, so those are, those are the Pokemon that we have that we can bring back. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Uh, we might just bring one on to replace Bully before the next episode and then wait on Denryu. I don't know. I haven't... Let me know what you guys think. Um, if you guys enjoyed that battle, that was that was a crazy tough battle. I did not expect that to go the way it did. Um, I'm glad we pulled out the W there, but that was, that was tough. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed, please leave a like. Let me know what you thought in the comments below. And I will see you guys next time for more Pokemon Hard Gold Ashlock Challenge. Thanks for watching. Bye.